What is up guys in today's video we're going to be going over some recent changes that fortnite just put out rebalancing some of the items in season four as always if you guys do enjoy this video remember to give it a like subscribe if you like to see more and comment down below what you think of these changes the background footage in the video is going to be from before the update because they actually put this out when i was editing a video that i intended to post today but now you know this happened so i'm making this so the get background gameplay doesn't have these changes uh, but I still think it's a very good update and I'm super excited to play the game after this. The uh, Captain America shield was nerfed. The damage was decreased from 60 to 50 when the shield hits you. This really isn't that big of a change, but it will require more accuracy now to hone in on the enemy. I'm not really sure how the game calculates this, but basically if you were close enough with the Captain America shield, it would just hit the person now that has been reduced by 40 percent so i guess it's going to be 40 percent more difficult to actually hit shots with the captain america shield obviously if your aim was good before it'll still be good but like it's just a little less forgiving now another huge change this is what i'm most excited for the block will now get stunned 50 percent easier so when someone just holds the shield out you could spray the shield and eventually you would do enough damage to like stun the player and stagger their block and then you would be able to get a lot of damage on the person right previously it was 500 damage you needed to stun the block it's now 250 so you need to do 250 damage to the shield when the player is blocking and then the player will get stunned and open up and allow you to beam them i think 250 is a much more reasonable number to hit you're going to be able to hit this faster which is nice because in theory you'll take less damage in the meantime but also have more ammo in your magazine to like spray and take advantage of the fact that you staggered their block. I feel like a lot of times I would stagger the block and then I would have to like maybe like five or six shots left and then I have to reload. So I think this is a great change and I think that's going to make the shield have a lot more counter play, which is something that I personally want. And then the spawn rate of this item was reduced. I've seen varying numbers on how much it was reduced by all the way up to like 30% and then as low as 20%. But either way, the spawn rate of the Captain America shield was reduced. So you should be seeing less of it in your matches, with it, which is great. The War Machine Arsenal was also nerfed. It will now take twice as long to reload the rockets. So if someone sprays out all the rockets, they're going to have to wait longer to be able to use more rockets. This should lead to way less spam when dealing with this item, but also make it feel like there's an end in sight because like if you throw a shield bubble and then they spam rockets on you, you can now take advantage of the time where they're reloading. Whereas like before it was so fast that like, did it even matter that you blocked the first barrage? Probably not. Uh, the structure damage on the rockets was also reduced from 100 to 80. So it's going to do less damage to builds and bunkers and walls. Not that big of a change like 80 damage is still a good amount so it's not like they nerfed it into the ground but it's not just gonna melt builds as easily and then the spawn rate was reduced by 50 percent in the avengers chests and 68 percent from regular chests so again you're gonna be seeing less of this around the map which i personally think is a good thing i i feel like the main problem of these two items not only was just how powerful they were but how every fight was just someone spamming the shield or spamming the rockets especially in team game modes like i don't know how anybody played squads at the start of this season like just four people spamming rockets or four people spamming the shield that should happen less now uh and then also the war machine arsenal was removed from the loot pool in tournaments so again i i think that is a good change and then also the sovereign shotgun got a minor buff with this update the ADS time was reduced by 25%, so you're going to be able to aim in faster, which is really nice for this shotgun because it has the effect of getting that added accuracy when you aim in. It incentivizes aiming, so being able to aim faster and do that a little more conveniently is nice, especially if you stack this with, with something like the angled foregrip for faster aim in time. And then the fire rate when aimed in was increased. I believe it was increased from 0.65 to 0.68. And that's shots per second. So this wasn't a massive change. You know, it, it's very minuscule, but it's still just a slight improvement to the weapon. The fire rate when hip firing was not changed at all. It's exclusively the aim down sight version of the fire rate that was slightly increased. So you're going to be able to aim in faster. 
and receive slightly less fire rate penalty for doing so. I don't think that fire rate penalty is going to change anything, but being able to aim in faster, I, I think will be uh, pretty nice with the shotgun since it already incentivizes it very much. But that is it for this update. It's just nerfs to the Captain America shield, nerfs to the war machine arsenal, and then a sm slight buff to the sovereign shotgun. I personally am very happy with this. Uh, obviously, if you guys watch my content, you probably know that I prefer not to partake in some of these really overpowered items. But even the shield and the war machine, I feel like using them, you would just kind of jetpack up and then throw it down. And I feel like playing against it wasn't really that enjoyable either. So I'm happy to see these changes. Let me know down in the comments below what you think of these changes. And if you are someone that was really upset maybe quitting this season I've, I've seen a lot of comments about that actually on my channel of people saying they're quitting this season or not playing anymore let me know if this change is going to make you give it a second chance i'm gonna let the gameplay play out uh in this video uh from a game i got today on stream the final player was a little sus i'm not sure if they were legitimate or not um but i will see you guys in the next one thanks for watching this season ah i feel like ammo hasn't been a concern of mine for years for pubs Why are you killing my house, man? Ugh, this is so troll. Because this guy behind me just rocketed my shit, I think. But, like, ideally for him, I would, like, clear this way and push up. And then he could take this and then shoot me in the back. Like, I don't know why he just did that. Because if this, this person right here is holding me, they're also holding him. Does he have heals? Yeah. Dude, this guy actually has the best aim ever. Like, what? But yeah, I I don't accuse people often. Like it, it's very rare, but that was very questionable. <laughs>